help you and you put your number on them. Okay, thank you. Uh-huh. All right, it's quarter past five on a chilly, but not too chilly, Saturday, 27th of January. It's 15 minutes before the start of the Sean O'Brien 100K. Uh, glad I remembered of head torch. I forgot you needed a head torch at the start of the race, so pretty dark. Let's get ready to rumble. Good morning, everyone. If you're standing here, you should be in the 100K, or if you're a 50 mile early start, just make sure that Melanie knows, okay? That helps us greatly. We need everyone's attention. You'll never go more than a half mile without seeing a marking. And if you get to a junction, the way I mark a course, is there are a million rivets going in the direction you're supposed to go. Five, four, three, two, one. Yahoo! Watch out for the arch, watch out for the arch. Watch out for the arch. Uh -huh. Time for the first crazy dance of 2024. Here we go. Okay, at two miles into the race, we have a river crossing. Feet are going to get wet. Change the shoes at mile 13. Just having my first bit of food, a little waffle. Oh, we got about five miles of uphill walking, so I got the poles out. Decided to take them from start to finish, just because the fitness isn't quite there, and I want to, you know, be be wise. It's uh run when we can run and walk when we should walk so all good so far ah enjoying it sun is starting to rise so we should see that next it's amazing up here right on cue ah you can tell this is already shaping up to be one hell of a day ah beautiful beautiful Okay, well the day has dawned, it's about 6.45 or so now in the morning, an hour and 15 minutes into the race. Most of the initial climbing is done and we settle into a steady rolling cadence for the next, oh I don't know, 10 miles or so before we hit a sharp descent. Okay, here we go. take my head torch off photographs been taken don't you know and I can see up ahead we're not very far at all from our first aid station Carl Canyon in or around eight miles seven and a half eight miles there thereabouts all going well yep there she blows Carl Canyon double seven Water? Water right here. Right here. Perfect. Right here. <laughs> Did I forget to mention that my number is 007? <laughs> Classic. Empty my trash, fill my water bottle. That was it. We'll see that again in God, I don't know how many miles. But so far so good. Yeah, on and on through this valley floor we have come. And now we are climbing out this side and then we'll drop down again what a day ah, up out of one canyon and now we drop down into another here before we climb up again to Canaan Road just broke a strap on my pole but could be worse I could have broken the pole so 
no biggie, but I do like using the straps. Past a few photographers there. Forgot to take my head torch off. When I took it off the first time, I looked for somewhere in my belt to put it, but had no space, so I decided the <laughs> best place for it was on my head. I'll drop it in Canaan though. I came over here last Saturday and there had been a lot of rainfall. Oops! Hope that hasn't been too distracting. There had been a lot of rainfall and this trail was an absolute mud fest. I couldn't even move on it. I had to go back to the car because it was just oh, unreal. All right, here we are coming down to Canaan Road. It's only about 13, 13.5 miles into the race, but I am going to stop here for a little while and change my shoes and socks and do a little bit of stuff just because fitness isn't where it needs to be. You can get away with certain things when you're as fit as you want to be, but when you're not, you got to look after the little things. So here we go. Alrighty. 007, you got it. License to kill. Thank you. All right, drop bags are here. 007. I'm looking for a kind of a backpack. I have two bags. Yeah, that one there too, sir. Exactly. Looking good. All right, leaving Canaan. Ah, new shoes, new socks, new water, new man. I'll see Claire at the next aid station because she is volunteering. Five and a half miles, apparently. Let's keep it rolling. All right, that was the 50k turnaround point. 2.5 miles on from Canaan. No turning around for me just yet. On and up we go. Three and a half hours in. We're up at Buzzard Roost Ranch. Looking down over the Pacific. Oh, windy. Wind at my back, at least for now. I don't know which direction it's going to be on my way back. Up this way. Ooh. All right, not far now. Let's go meet up with Claire. Woo! 007 reporting for duty, sir. <laughs> <Woo -hoo! laughs> okay, I'm away. I'll see how I look the next time too. Like that? No, no, I'm good now. Right, She's looked after. Thanks, Paolo. Yeah. No, 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 I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. All right, let's go. Oh, the party's starting now. Whoa, that was a bit of fun. Great to see Claire. Lovely lift. Now we got about four miles down to Bonso. And then eight miles back up a different direction to that same point. Which is gonna be bloody murder. But for now, we drop. We always seem to either dropping or climbing on this race. Ah! Double O seven to you. <laughs> You're going bananas. Perfect, lovely. Thank you, sir. Oh, mind if I sit down here? Thank you. Thank you, guys. All right. Now nah, I'm good. Thank you. All right. That's it, you got it! Alright, good job. Good job. I just realised there that my lens was caked with my goo gel or something. Sorry about that. I'm not sure what it's going to do to the footage, but <laughs> we'll salvage what we can. Alright, onwards. Eight miles straight up, so I have changed. Put on a little peaky cap since we're into the middle of the day. And I have put on a backpack with a bladder just for ease of drinking while climbing, climbing, climbing. But I've kept my belt, which I will switch back to a little later on. Okay, that was 23 miles. Still a long way to go, but we're past one third. Should we have a dance? I'm not sure. Nah, too dangerous. Nah, feeling pretty good. 
all things considered. I'm going to go back up to Clare again after eight miles from the aid station. That will be the halfway point. Up and up and up we go. It reminds me of a certain scene in my Cape Rat Ultra video. Uh, it's just climbing, climbing, climbing. Up from the up from the uh, up from the river, yeah. And then I was rewarded with an amazing view. Let's see what we get up here. Uh, this one's not too bad either. Beautiful. A little bit of descent to fool us into a false sense of security. Because we're heading. See those trees way up on that hill far yonder? That's that rooster, something rooster, buzzard roost ranch. That's what that is up there. But they're gonna bring us down first. Ah, oh, river. I think I shall wet my buff. Ah, oh. ah, oh. ah. Oh. Oh, oh, that's good. That is good. Ah, oh. oh. ah. There we go. Oh, oh yeah. Ah, oh. ah. Oh. oh, that's nice. Onto the arms, onto the legs. Oh yeah. Beautiful. All right. That's nice. I throw it around my neck for a little while. All right, back to climbing. Those trees up at Rooster, what is it? Buzzard Roost Ranch. Starting to look a little bit closer, I gotta say. Yeah, starting to look a lot closer. Aha, the end of the climb is in sight. And look who's come down. <laughs> Here it comes now. Here comes my man, looking strong on a very, very hot day. Woo! Slap the flag! How was that? Good. Oh, I work! Oh, great service there from Howlow, Claire and the rest of the gang at the Zuma Ridge aid station. Had myself some watermelon, a vegan wrap with hummus and avocado. Topped up my water, threw on some extra sunscreen. It's hot out here today. 24, 25 degrees, I don't know. Hot. Ah, but now, look how close the trees are now. That's where we're heading, Buzzard Roost. Those are the trees. Those are the trees we saw from a long, long way away. Oh yeah. Oh, Wendy. Thank you, Buzzard Roost Ranch. I feel like we've had a special relationship these last few hours. I'm gonna miss you. I hope you're gonna miss me too. All right, on to Canaan, let's go. Yes, I see him here. I got it. <laughs> oh, check out this sandwich. Man here. They're doing an amazing job. All right, thank you. 007 on another mission. Oh, I just passed a the sign there. The Coral Canyon, 2.8 miles. But I did underestimate my water requirements. So I am pretty much running on dry now, so not good, but 2.8 miles, let's just chunk it out, starting to meet people from other races now as well, I think these are 50 k's maybe, I'm not sure, 
Oh, we're coming up here to Carl Canyon. My throat is as dry as. Answers in the comment section. Oh, water. I need water. Oh, just taking a bit of time to try and get some water down. Very dehydrated, but the water's going down slow. Let's see what we can do. Oh, oh no, that didn't go well at all. Whew. Oh, yeah, stomach emptying episode. Oh. Whew. But I have managed to take a ginger, I take a little bit of banana, and a little bit of wrap. I'm grateful of this one mile uphill walk after the aid station. It's all downhill after that, but hopefully this will help settle me. We'll be able to fall down the hill. Oh, whew, that was a rough one. That was rough, but we're still in here. Okay, let the long descent begin. About five, six miles maybe. The turn round point. Oh, buoy, buoy! I say, race leader. Oh, Second, ah, oh, Mr. Mr. Leader. But yes, we should see the people at the beginning of the race. Not the beginning of the race, but the front of the race, coming back up against us now. So that was. The guy in second, perhaps the guy in first has already gone past. Oh, I was sipping water and getting away with it once I tried some food and I did not go down, literally. And now we are entering the Cypher Mash 4077 with film 12, the external scenes. Check it out where the helicopter is flying in through these canyons. Wow, oh, well done, second lady. You too. Finally, bulldog. Ah, oh. ah. Oh. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Oh, man alive. Okay. Welcome. Ah, oh. ah. Oh, memories of Leadville. Taking uh, ten minutes out just to gather myself. This woman was my angel. What's your name? Mary Kay. Mary Kay. Let me give you a hug. Okay. Oh. We're gonna oh. Fine. Thank you What's so much. What's your name? Dave. Dave. What's this? Moochie. Yeah. Moochie. Yeah. Moochie. Yeah. Moochie. Okay. Thank you. Oh. Oh. Thank you. Whoo! It's only rougher to get in. Ah, oh, Mary Kay. Oh goodness. Whoo! Moochie. Ah, back to the mash site. Ah, the sun is setting. It's been a long day. Struggling big time now, but confident I will see the finish line. Goal is 16 hours now, which is a Western States qualifier. That's 11 hours 40 now, so let's see what happens made it to the top of the climb hallelujah one mile downhill to the final aid station Carl Canyon oh I think I'll just get water and keep going on my merry way the kind soul gave me a small can of coke there a little while back though so I managed to drink a little bit of it sugar and that so I'm happy with that all right one mile and the aid station Oh, hey. oh, Hi. Hi everybody. Hello. Alright, leaving the last aid station. We're having some good fun with the 007 number I've been assigned. Finish the mission. Don't let us down, Mr. Bond, you're our best agent. And so on and so forth. Alright, about seven and a half miles to the finish line. 25 so should be comfortably under 16 anyway for the Western States qualifier. 
It's a little bit chilly now, so I'm going to try an extra top to take me home. Oh, after one last tough descent or ascent there, I think now we're descending for about four miles. Can you see any of the lights out there? Air flowing water, that can mean only one thing. Ah. Whoa! Whoop. Oh, man. Oh. Ah! All right. That's this. Two miles. And we are back down on terra firma. Only about half a mile to go. Oh, thank goodness for that. 007. Mission accomplished. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm waiting for the kids. Nice work. Good job, guys. Bio and